Hello YouTube. So no guitar video hour session today. Sorry. Basically, uh, I'm going to just uh, give you some guitar wisdom of mine to you. I don't even need the guitar to teach it because a lot of the guitar, um, you know, skills that come in, in the later years, you know, after putting in the 10,000 hours, just basically come from knowing the, just memorizing it, memorizing it, muscle memory. There comes a lot to it. But yes. So. I want to just uh, share that and also just welcome you guys again to my to my channel and just put more content up. Really, that's the whole gist of this and this this video, short little video. Um, let me go ahead and think about something I want to share on the guitar. Basically, there are, I think I mentioned this, I guess I'm going to grab the guitar after all, my acoustic. And I'll show you guys my acoustic. I recently got some new, one new sticker on it. Um, but yeah, this is it. My baby. Her name's Lucy. Got some stickers on there. I got a couple more stickers that are um, under the guitar. And it's, I don't know if I got any down here. I don't think so. And then I got one up here. Nice. One of my favorite ones. And then I got one. My, one of my favorite ones right here. You see like the couple, uh, Characters and Marvel characters, and then that's the most recent one. Um, but yeah, uh, guitar stuff. So there are 12 notes in the musical alphabet to be able to um, to put it in on like in perspective. Like look at the keyboards on the on the keys on the piano. 88 notes, 12 of them um, make up the the musical scale. A A sharp B B sharp, no, B, C, C sharp, D, D sharp, the E, E sharp, and I don't know, and then E, and then F, and then F sharp, and then G, G sharp, A. Yeah, that's, that's 12, I believe. I messed up on the E and F. Apparently there's a, there's no sharps, or, or an E flat, there's no E sharp, and there's no F flat, and um, and there's no, and the same goes for E, F or B as well. So there's no B sharp, and there's no C flat note. There just isn't one. There's just B to C, and then E to F, and that just comes with practice. Knowing that, um, and kind of understanding that initially, can help you kind of decipher what's going on on the guitar and understand the the reasons why one chord or one note sounds a little bit nicer when when you play it than other notes, right? That's just music theory stuff. Uh, but I, I I learned that um if you want to learn the notes on the actual fretboard, try practicing them, uh, practicing the the guitar and and just memorizing just the the major notes. The, just the just ignore the sharps and flats initially, and then and then learn all the just the A B C D E F G. That's basically the, the how it goes A B C D E F G. And then there's sharps and flats in between those, but um, one or the other. I think there's a certain way to read music. <laughs> um, but yeah, and so um, just memorize and find all the the major notes on the on the neck board, and then jump on learning the the sharps and flats. But there's a couple um, f fun little tunes you can make with just the major notes alone because they're just so nice. <laughs> And, and toned and, and frequency basically yeah that's just something i wanted to share um, just some knowledge and just just put some content this might not be the the most eloquent lesson on it uh, there's other several youtube channels that i've been watching that helped me learn this stuff and i'm still learning it i still don't know it all you see i, I stumbled on on uh, e and b b and e and but i, I mean through practice right and um, that's what's going to happen when you keep playing the guitar just through practice, you learn the stuff, and then also your body actually does memorize it. You, your brain and your and your get like a muscle memory kind of, kind of um, magic going on when you when you play. It's uh, intuitive sometimes, but at the same time you kind of have to just hear it. That's all it is, right? Music is, it's all about vibrations and feeling it and, and hearing it. So, um, yeah, that's all I got for you guys. If you guys want to like and subscribe, you guys totally can. If not. Totally cool, but like and subscribe. I also want to promote my Instagram, so you guys follow me on Instagram, um, Pan, Raul Panchito, 
music at gmail oh, at gmail.com <laughs> Raul Panchito music and then I, I made a TikTok same thing Raul Panchito music so check it out check it out uh, I, I want to definitely be posting more and using social media and just, just being active on there um, you know be be grateful for all you have as well ultimately the last last thing I wanted to say before I dip out man I gotta cut my nails what is going on anyways um, yeah be grateful for what you have you know I just be be mindful that there's more to to life, you know. There's more to you. There's bigger things out there, you know. Get over yourself, really. But that's what I learned, you know. But, but be grateful. Be grateful for everything, you know. There's things things only come once in a lifetime, sometimes, you know. Um, yeah, love you guys. Thank you for watching. And um, special shout out to Estilo Mexico, you know, showing love always. All right, guys. Peace.